we all have disaster stories, tales that drive us to perform the work that we love. We all impact the lives of other humans in a most critical way. It's been a great networking opportunity. It's drawing together people in the Washington community and beyond who are in a sense a community of practice but who don't have the opportunity to meet that often, to come together, to discuss, to learn, to share, and to think about the future. How we can use data to improve humanitarian response and so it's been very interesting for me to learn from my colleagues about how they are using data and how they would like to use data. It's also helpful for us to know where people are headed uh, so that we can provide the solutions that they will need for future humanitarian emergencies. I have recommended the summit to my colleagues and I would recommend any opportunity that people have to come together and to build on each other's, to learn from each other's experiences um, and to share lessons. I'm really impressed by the level of participation, the great engagement, but I think the most important thing is that it's always on cutting edge issues. It's really going to require all of us from the different sectors in which we work coming together. And this summit is, has been really great at facilitating the discussion. We wanted to share our experience at the World Bank with post-disaster recovery. We wanted to learn about good practice from others. And we wanted to be able to use this as an opportunity to both reinforce and develop partnerships. I would absolutely recommend the summit to my colleagues in the international development community as an opportunity to efficiently and effectively share information and learn about good practice. These forums are very important for the exchange of ideas, for debate, and for hopefully for collaboration. It looks like a very rich and, and diverse agenda, so I'm looking to learn from the, the various sessions and also uh, network with other practitioners in the field. The World Bank Group's um, dual mission is about um, resolving extreme poverty as well as um, boosting um, uh, shared prosperity. And we have measures and metrics in place for hitting some very stretch goals by 2030. This is, a, this is a simulation exercise. And so today you are not going to be sitting in your seats for very long, maybe 20 minutes as we explain the simulation. You will be standing, walking around, interacting with each other. The objective here is to experience and discuss common cross-sector challenges that we are faced with during and after disasters. At UNHCR, um, we've established seven um, global stockpiles. And those stockpiles, we have to be prepared to respond to a 600-person emergency within 72 hours. And that can be multiple emergencies at the same time. It was a great opportunity to learn about what other people are doing, um, and also an excellent opportunity to network and meet with, uh, with those individuals. So the structured panels, as well as the informal meetings, uh, were really useful.